Once upon a time, there was a prince who wanted to marry a princess, but only a real princess would do. He traveled all over the world to find one. Yet everywhere he went, things went wrong. There were plenty of princesses, but how would the prince know whether they were the real princess? There was something not quite right about them all. So the prince returned home quite unhappy because he would have liked very much to bring back a real princess to meet the king and the queen. One evening, a terrible storm struck. Lightning boomed, lightning flashed across the sky, and rain slapped against the castle windows. It really was frightful. In the middle of the night came a knock on the gate. The old king went to open it. Who should be standing there but the princess, or so she said. Good gracious, what a sight. She was all in the rain and wind. Water ran down her hair and her clothes, into her shoes and out her heels. Yet she claimed to be the real princess. We'll soon find out about that, the old queen said. Without another word, the queen went straight into the royal guest room, took off all the bedding on the bed, and carefully placed one pea on the mattress. Then she took twenty pillows and bears and piled them on top of the pea. The next morning, the queen asked her, Did you sleep well, my dear? Oh, exclaimed the princess. No, I hardly closed my eyes at all. Heaven only knows what's in that bed. I laid on something so hard, I'm black and blue all over. It was terrible. The queen smiled, the king laughed, and the prince's eyes grew wide. The family could see that the girl was the real princess because she felt to pee through twenty bears and twenty pillows. No one but the real princess could be as delicate as that. The prince wasted no time in asking her to marry him, for he found his real princess at last. As for the pea, it was put in the Royal Museum, where it still may be seen unless someone has taken it. There, that's a true story.